This has been a really unusual year, hasn't it? We've all had to get used to doing lots of things in new ways. For many of us in schools, we've had to think of new ways to do things we've been doing for years. Usually before the AQE test mornings, we hold a familiarisation evening when we invite in all the boys and girls coming to sit the test in the Royal School. On that evening, we talk to the pupils and their parents and show them the room they are going to be in on the three test mornings. We aren't able to do that this year, and so we have produced this little video presentation to help you better understand how it's going to be done. All our preparations have you, the boys and girls doing the test, at the centre of them, and we aim to make this as simple a process as it can possibly be. Please remember that this is different for everyone doing the test, so everyone is having a similar experience. You do not need to worry. You've all worked really hard to prepare for the test, and now it's over to us to make sure it runs smoothly. Our priority is to keep up the high standards of safety that you've become used to in primary school. All our desks will be at least two metres from each other. You will be told which room you are going to be in and which entrance you should use. On each of the Saturday mornings, there will be lots of people here to answer any of your questions and make sure you know exactly what you need to do and where you need to go. If you or your parents have any questions, don't worry. Just ring us and we will be more than happy to answer them. I want to commend you for all your hard work so far and wish you every success on the test mornings. Thank you. Welcome to our virtual familiarisation event. This year, we have children sitting the test in the Royal School from 50 primary schools. The test consists of three one-hour and 10-minute papers, and the best two papers out of the three count. The dates of the tests are the 9th, 16th, and 23rd of January each test commencing at 10 a.m. sharp. You should arrive in the school between 9 o'clock and 9.30. We've tried to make the process as user-friendly as possible for all the pupils, despite the current COVID-19 restrictions. As far as possible, you will be grouped with pupils from your own primary school. On arrival at the school, Pupils other than those from the Armstrong Primary School and the Cope Primary School should drive through the main entrance following the signage and leave their children for collection by a member of staff at the drop-off point. Children will be escorted directly to the room they have been allocated where they will be registered. Pupils from the Cope and the Armstrong Primary Schools should park in the Armstrong Primary Car Park and access the school via the front door. The classroom arrangements this year are the sports hall, the assembly hall and two other classrooms. For those pupils who have applied for special access arrangements, we will be using separate classrooms. On the day of the test, dress code is school uniform please. If you don't have a, a school uniform, please do not wear football or rugby tops. If there's any illness of children during the tests, we have a school nurse who will be on site for the duration. On each of the Saturdays, children must bring with them their AQE examination card, two pencils, a rubber, and any emergency medications such as inhalers as necessary. Children must not bring onto the school mobile phones, any other electronic devices, pencil cases, rulers, or watches. In the event of an emergency, we will contact the parents using the mobile contact number we have been given by AQE. The arrangements for departure are, pupils will leave by their primary school grouping in approximate five minute intervals for collection by their parents in the school playground. This is with the exception of pupils from the Armstrong and the Cope Primary School who will join their parents in the Armstrong car park. We look forward to seeing you on the first of the tests on the 9th of January. Mm -hmm.